So you want to become A plus or Network Plus certified. Well, you've definitely come to the right place. If you're a career changer or just someone getting started on pursuing their IT certifications, these classes are perfect for you. Both certifications are presented by CompTIA, and TrainAce has meshed these two classes together in a way which will benefit you and give you the hands-on experience you need to get your career started. Both A Plus and Network Plus are considered entry-level certifications. They will provide attendees with a strong foundation for entry into the IT field in both beginner and mid-level positions. They are also a key ingredient when attempting higher-level networking classes. Many other certifications assume you have the essential background you will gain from A Plus and Network Plus when you're attempting to achieve them. The strong knowledge base you'll have in PC hardware and operating systems after completing these courses will give you exactly what you need to move into a successful career. At Train A's, our classes are presented in a unique way. They are 60% hands-on so that not only will you pass a designated exam, but you will walk away with the experience needed to be a reliable employee. Of course, we offer the classes separately, but they are always run back-to-back -to, -back to enable participants to knock them both out at once. This 12-day combination class will set you up to take the three necessary exams to get certified and on your way to a career in IT. So what exactly does being a or Network Plus certified mean? Well, they are perfect certs for career changers, especially if you had no IT background and are trying to work your way into the field. They increase your credibility as an IT professional and make you more valuable to a potential employer. If you are contemplating on whether or not to jump into a career in IT, there's one major thing you should know. There's always room for improvement and for more knowledge. These two certs are just stepping stones into the giant pool that is the IT industry. They will help you gauge what area of IT interests you and where you want to take your career from there. What also is the big plus is the jump in salary you can see just from becoming certified. Individuals holding their A-plus certification make about $38,000 a year starting and receive up to an 11% raise in the first year alone. That's after they get some experience under their belt. Pair A-plus with Network Plus and see the jump immediately. Individuals with both make about $43,000 starting. A lot of people decide to venture towards Security Plus after they're comfortable with the knowledge obtained at the beginner's level. Once you do this, expect to make about $47,000 annually. Now, these numbers vary greatly depending on the region you reside in, but one thing is for sure, salaries will continue to greatly rise as you become more experienced and gain more certifications and training. The combination course begins with A-plus training. This is a rigorous 56-hour training schedule which prepares attendees for higher level networking classes. It is key in any IT career. During class, you'll learn the ins and outs of basic computer systems and become extremely familiar with installation, preventative maintenance, network security, and troubleshooting. In many cases, people with this background choose to work with the public in the role of a help desk technician or support specialist. With this in mind, you'll also go over customer service and communication skills, which will make you a better tech to the customer. It's very important to learn patience when you're in roles like these. When researching job roles, look for titles such as Service Technician and Support Specialist. These key terms are often used when describing roles you'll hopefully be assigned to. So becoming a certified can be a little tricky to understand at first. Since it's a beginner course, CompTIA wants to make sure everyone understands both terms as well as hands-on aspects of the material covered. Therefore, you must take two exams to become completely certified. The first, a Essentials, measures for the necessary competency of an entry-level IT professional. This is the terms and concepts part I was just talking about. The exam tests for the understanding of computer technology, networking and security skills, communication skills, and professionalism that's required by IT professionals. The second exam, a Practical Application, is exactly as the name states. It applies the skills identified in a Essentials to practical situations and troubleshooting problems. The problems make the test taker decide where and when certain tools should be used to resolve technical problems. The second portion of the combination course focuses on getting attendees Network Plus certified. This training includes 40 hours and prepares students for advanced level networking classes and certifications. Network Plus training focuses on topics such as installation, configuration, media management, and security. If you do not have a background in IT, it's important that you're familiar with basic IT terms and concepts before jumping into Network Plus. A Plus will prepare attendees perfectly and set them up to move immediately to Network Plus. Upon completion, jobs such as Network Technician, Installer, Administrator will be in your realm of expertise. Unlike A Plus, Network Plus certification only requires one exam. 
It was just updated December 2011, so it's important that if you choose to study on your own, you are studying the correct material. The older version of the exam expired August 31, 2012. The newer version places emphasis on virtual networking and security since that's definitely a booming topic. The exam tests for understanding of network hardware, installation, and troubleshooting. It also tests on knowledge in network connections and software, as well as on protocols used in local and wide area networks. CompTIA does list a as a recommended prerequisite for the same reasons I just stated, but it's not mandatory. Testers are given 90 minutes to answer 100 questions. A passing score is 720 on a scale of 100 to 900. Another huge reason to go after these certs is because they can be found on the DOD Directive 8570. So what exactly does that mean? Well, the Department of Defense instated these guidelines to provide specific procedures for the uniform training of government employees who conduct information assurance functions in their day-to-day -day jobs. Individuals working for the Department of Defense are required to carry an approved certification for their particular job classification. This increases and keeps current the knowledge base of everyone working within the field of information assurance. You can find a and Network Plus under Level 1 of the three-tiered technical level of compliance. If you're even thinking of working for the government in a field of IT, it's mandatory that you receive training and gain these certifications to get or keep your job. The actual directive in its entire context can be found at the link listed at the bottom of the screen. No matter what your reasons for becoming certified, be it job requirements or career change, TrainAce will help you get on the right track. We have two convenient locations in Greenbelt, Maryland and Ashburn, Virginia. Our subject matter instructors are well versed and provide attendees with intensive hands-on training. If your facility needs us to bring our capabilities to you, that's not a problem. Call us today at 877-564-8724 to discuss your training needs directly with one of our wonderful training coordinators. Well, that's all for now. Thank you, and I look forward to hearing from you.